Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord for this is the day that the Lord has made. And truly, 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 we are grateful for you, you and you that have uh, joined us on this wonderful Monday. My goodness gracious, this is the last Monday in the month of October. Can you believe it? We've made it to 10 months, getting ready to go into the 11th. And then we have one more month and that's the 12th month, the month of my birth. Amen. December 4th is my birthday, and I'm telling you, people of God, you need to mark your calendars now because I'm telling you on December 4th, we're going to have the biggest virtual birthday party that Facebook has ever seen. So we are just delighted and excited about all that God is getting ready to do in the life of his people. I'm as particularly excited about life, health, and strength. And it is my prayer that God has blessed you on today, that he's allowed you to um, come right where you are so that God can move in your life on today. We thank God for the power of prayer. We thank God for his intercessors, his God, God's intercessors. I'm telling you, it pays to pray, y'all. It pays to pray. And I'm telling you, prayer is the key and faith unlocks the door. And I'm so delighted and excited about the power of prayer. And I know that prayer works. I know that prayer is able um, to move mountains, change situations and circumstances, heal the sick, raise the dead, do some really great and wonderful things in your life. If you allow God to do it. Amen. So I'm just excited on tonight as we gather. I promise you, I won't keep you long. We just want to pray and intercede for the things that's going on um, in our in our world, in our culture, in our community, in our homes. There's so many pressing issues that we as the saints of God are going through. Let me tell you something. Just because you say sanctified and filled with the Holy Ghost don't mean that you won't go through. Oh, my goodness gracious. Just because, you know, you can move mountains, you know, through the power of prayer don't mean that every now and again, you yourself won't be attacked. This is why you got to stay in a mode of prayer and position yourself in prayer so that like the Bible says, when the enemy comes in like a flood, that the Lord will lift up a standard and God will make a way of escape for you. And I'm telling you, I'm praying today. Glory to God for our protection, for our uh, our sanity, our mental health. This is the season, people of God, as the holidays approach, a lot of people get into a lot of depression and oppression because they may not have all the things that they would desire for their family during Thanksgiving or desire for uh, Christmas. But I'm telling you, saints of God, you better know, don't be moved by holiday because one thing for certain, and one thing for sure, a holiday will come and go. But you got to learn to keep your mental sanity intact. And you got to not be moved by what the world is doing. Too many of us as, as believers get so caught up in what the world is doing. Y'all better take your eyes off the world and put your eyes on God. I was just ministering to somebody not too long ago. That is imperative that you keep your mind and your focus on Christ. You know, heaven and earth shall pass away. His word will stand, but he's the one who can destroy body and soul. And so no matter what, you got to keep your hand in the hand of the man who stills the water. No matter what, glory to God, you got to hold on. You got to hold on to God's unchanging hand because ultimately God's going to see you through. I don't care what you say. God, did you hear what I say? God's going to see you through. When your back is against the wall, when you, nobody else, only God can do it. There's some things right now that's going on in my life that only God can. But you know what, y'all? I trust him to do it. I got to trust God to do it. Because if God don't do it, guess what? It can't be done. And you got to come to a point in your life that you have to say, it is well with my soul. It is well. God, I put it in your hand. And so we're going to pray today. We're going to pray that God will have his perfect will and way in our life. Let me tell you something. When God is moving in your life, hear me. When God is moving in your life, then guess what, y'all? You're not moved by nothing else except for God. And that's where we have to get to the point in our life. Let God move in your life. So in order to do that, we're going to have to bind up principalities. We're going to have to bind up evil forces that don't want us to believe, that don't want us to, to move in faith because the devil is fighting your faith. Honey, he, 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 trust me, he is fighting your faith. He wants you to throw on a towel. He wants you to thank God ain't going to come to your rescue because there's some things in life, people of God, only God can do it. 
And you got to wait on God. You got to patiently wait on God to perform the miracle. You got to patiently wait on God to do the impossible thing in your life. You got to wait on God. And so that's where you have to get to the point. And so you say to yourself, well, how do I wait on God? How do I keep waiting on God when it looks so blink? How do I keep waiting on God with a smile on my face when I don't feel right? When I'm hurt and when I'm in pain. But guess what, y'all? You still got to hold on to God's unchanging hand because he's the author and finisher of our faith. And so we got to hold on to what God said. We got to hold on and believe God. And so I admonish you today as we go to the throne of grace, let us pray and ask God to expand our faith and, and, and cause us to walk in faith and not in fear and not be moved by what we see but be moved by what we know. Glory to God. They that wait upon the Lord shall be renewed. They shall mount up as wings as eagle. They shall soar. They shall run. They shall not be weary. You got to decree and declare the, the word of the Lord in our life. We got to say, I refuse to be weary in this season. So we're going to pray for strength. And I'm telling you, if you're feeling weary today, the great thing about this platform is that God can touch you right where you are. Right where you are, the city you are, whether you be in your living room, in your car, on your job, wherever you are tonight, God can meet you at your point of need. And even for those of you that's on the rebroadcast, God can meet you right where you are. He can touch you right where you are. The blessings and the anointing, glory to God, will fall on you, even if you're in the rebroadcast. May the power of the Holy Ghost be your portion tonight. May God move mountains in your life tonight. May favor be your portion. Hallelujah. So let us pray, beloved. Father God, in the name of Jesus, we come before you today, God. We thank you for another day that you've allowed us to gather here, God. We don't take it for granted, God. And Father, we just thank you because there is a people, oh God, that refuse to defile their garment. There is a people that's still holding on to your unchanging hand. There's still a people, oh God, that knows how to cry out to you, God. There's still a people, oh God, that have not lost trust, that have not lost hope, that have not lost faith, God, and they're holding on. They yet Yet holding on, God, yet holding on with tears in their eyes, yet holding on, oh God, heavy laden and heavy burden, God. But Father, I thank you, God, that you have made us to be a soldier. God, you've made us to be an unmovable soldier, God. And Father, we thank you today for unmovable faith, God, unshakable faith, God. Thank you that we are the planted of the Lord, God. Thank you, God, that in spite of what we're going through, in spite of what we see, God, we yet still believe. We yet still believe, God, that you're well able, God, to do exceedingly above all that we could have imagined, God. We thank you on tonight, God, for the power of prayer. But most importantly, God, we thank you for the spirit of unity, God. We thank you that we can come together and touch and agree on earth, God. Oh, God. God, and you promised, oh God, that you would back us up today, God. Hallelujah. God, we thank you. God, you said wherever two or three are gathered in your name, God. Oh God, if we decree something on earth, God, that you would back us up in heaven, oh God. Father, we thank you today, oh God, for what you are doing. God, thank you, God. Thank you for the power of prayer today, God. Oh God, hallelujah. With all that we're going through day in and day out, what we have is our faith. What we have is our prayer life. What we have is our relationship, God. And Father, thank you this night, God, for relationship, God. Thank you for being our relationship. You said in your word, oh God, uh, that if we cast our cares upon you, uh, oh God, you promise to be our burden bearer. Uh, you promise to be our burden sharer. Uh, you promise, oh God, uh, to make ways out of no way for your children, God. Uh, thank you today, God. Uh, God, that you're such an awesome father, God. Uh, God, that if we need water, God, uh, God, that you will provide it for us in the desert, God. Uh, whatever we stand in need of, God, uh, you said that you would work it out for us, oh God. Uh, oh God, we thank you today, God. Uh, God, we're not shaking and we're not move by what we see, God, but we're moved by our faith, God. Oh, God, I pray today, God, for those that are struggling today, God, struggling in their faith, God, struggling in their mind, struggling in their finances, struggling, oh, God, oh, God, with all things all around them, chaos on every hand, God. But Father, oh, God, I pray today, God, in the name of the Lord Jesus, God, that you would do it for your people, oh, God. Break every yoke, break every chain, break 
break every fetter today, God. In the name of your Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Oh God, do it for your people today, God. Oh God, that they will be moved. Move for better. Move for greater. Move for a greater relationship with you, God. In the name of Jesus. God, we want to know you, God. We want to know, God, that you have our back today, God. Oh God, I pray today, God. God, that you will look upon us today, God. Oh God, even the things that we don't understand, God. Because there's some people that just don't understand. But God, help us to understand. Help us to understand your will and your way, your direction, your instruction for our lives. God, I pray for the spirit of purpose, God, to fall upon your people today, God, that they will know you. Oh, God, and they will know their purpose, God, in the name of Jesus, that they will not be tricked by the enemy, God. In the name of Jesus. Oh God, I thank you today, God, for being a healer, God. Oh God, we thank you for healing, God. Oh God, healing is the children's bread. Thank you that by the stripes of Jesus Christ, we are healed, God. I pray this day, God, for a healing of the mind. I pray, God, that you will heal our mind. You said, let this mind be in you, which was also in Christ Jesus. I pray, God, for the minds of your people, oh God. Help us to focus. Help us not to be distracted. Help us, oh God, in the name of Jesus. Heal our mind. Help us. Help us to exceed, oh God, in the name of Jesus. Help us today, God. Oh God, to focus. To focus. We bind up distraction. We rebuke it in the name of the Lord Jesus. And God, we bring our focus in. We bring our minds in. We bring our minds in to serve you. We bring our minds to worship you. We bring our minds in. In the name of Jesus. Every contrary thought, we take subject of authority over it in the name of Jesus. Oh God, let our minds oh God, please you in the name of Jesus. Oh God, we pray today, God. God, oh God, that you will touch our hearing, God, that we will be able to hear, hear you and hear you alone, God. We bind up the negative words of the naysayers. We bind up the negative words of the enemy. We bind up the negative words of Satan that said that we're not going to make it, that we're not going to prevail in this pandemic, that we're not going to prevail. Oh God, in the next spread. Oh God, we bind up the hand of the enemy that will try to poison our mind against our purpose and against our destiny. Ah, Satan, the Lord God rebuke you in the name of Jesus. Oh God, we cast him out. Oh God, from our hearing God, that we will no longer hear negative thoughts, negative ways, negative things spoken to us. We bind you in the name of Jesus, the blood of Jesus, the blood, the blood of Jesus. Oh God, against every negative the word uh, that's being whispered in our ear. Uh, we bind you, Satan, uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, we take authority. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, we rebuke the spirit of fear. Uh, and we loose God, uh, the spirit of faith now, uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, that your people will believe, uh, that your people will believe, uh, that the people of God will believe. Uh, we will believe, we believe the report of the Lord. We will believe the report of the Lord. We will believe the word of the Lord in the name of Jesus. Let the word, oh God, be whispered into our ear. Let the word be in our mind. Let the word be our portion. Let us rely on the word, the word, the word, the word, the word, the word of God. We decree it. We decree it. We decree it. The word of God is our portion in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. And Father, now we pray, God, for our sight, God. Let us see what you would have us to see. Oh, God, everything that you have for us, let us see it, God. And if we can see it, God, we can receive it, God, in the name of Jesus. And we bind up. Oh, God, rose colored glasses. Oh, God, the negativity all around us. We bind it in the name of Jesus. Let us see what you would have us to see in the spirit realm, God. Oh, God, we pray now, God, uh, that you remove the scales from our eyes, uh, that we will be able to see what you would have us to see, God. Uh, oh, God, that we will not look to the left or to the right, uh, but we will look up to the hills uh, and know that our help coming from you uh, in the name of Jesus. Uh, and oh, God, we pray now, God. Uh, oh, God, in the young daughter of Ashanda, uh, God, that you will touch our mouth. Uh, oh, God, that our mouth will be the uh, uh, word of the Lord. Uh, we pray now, God. Uh, oh, God, that life and death lies in the power of our tongue. Uh, help us to speak uh, godly 
negative things. Help us to speak what you would have us to speak. We bind up negative things. Proceed it out of our mouth. We bind up gossip. We bind up backbiting. We bind up lying in the name of Jesus. Help us to talk that which you would have us to talk. Help us to be the righteousness of the Lord. Help us to soften our words. Help us to speak in love in the name of Jesus. Touch our mouth. You know that we will speak that which you say God now father oh God we pray oh God for our bodies today you said oh God oh God oh God let our bodies be holy and righteous in your sight help us oh God in the name of the Lord Jesus God if there be any sickness in us that should not be God we bind it we cast it out in the name of Jesus because healing healing is the children's bread and anything contrary to what you said we denounce it we curse it at the root God oh God in the name of Jesus oh God heal us heal us from the inside out God everything that's dormant everything that's lurking everything that we cannot see God your eyes are to and fro God in the name of Jesus deliver us from all evil every sickness and disease oh God deliver 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 oh God in the name of Jesus Oh God, we decree it to be so God. Deliver, Lord. God, deliver. Deliver, 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 deliver. Oh God, and we pray right now, God. God, that you will look upon your people, oh God. That you will God, that you would deliver your people, oh God, from every matter of sickness and disease, God. Help us to believe that you are a great physician. Help us to trust in you, God. Help us to take you at your word, oh God. In the name of the Lord Jesus. We pray, God, right now, God, that you would move, God, oh, God, for those that are fighting and battling this terrible disease called COVID-19, God. I pray for those that's on the bed of affliction, oh, God, in it, I will shut down. God, I pray right now, God, God, that you would be their nurse, that you would be their physician, that you would raise them up off that bed of affliction. You're yet still a healer. You're yet still a deliverer. You're yet still a way maker. Oh, God, do it in the name of Jesus. Move for your people today, God. Heal that of the Oh God, heal your people today, oh God. Oh God, heal God. Heal us, oh God. Heal us from this tragedy called COVID-19, God. Oh God, I pray for the young to the old. Oh God, I pray, God. Oh God, help us. Oh God, right now, Lord, we pray even now, God, for this upcoming election, oh God. Oh God, you God. And beside thee, around thee, there is none like thee. Oh God, in you, we put our trust in. In you, do we pray to. In you, oh God. God, we uh, put our all in all in you, God. Uh, and Father, in the name of Jesus, uh, I pray, God, uh, that your voice will be heard uh, on November 3rd. Uh, in the name of Jesus, uh, let your voice uh, resound uh, in this country. Uh, let freedom ring. Uh, let liberty prevail. Uh, let freedom ring. Uh, oh, God, I pray today, God. Uh, let freedom ring. Uh, let freedom ring. Uh, we bind up uh, any unrest. Uh, we bind up every Every civil unrest. We bind up every plot and plan of the enemy even now. In the name of Jesus, we bind up every militia group that their guns will not fire. In the name of Jesus, we bind them. In the name of Jesus, Holy Ghost fire. God, we pray for divine intervention. In the name of the Lord Jesus, God, let chaos fill their camps that they will not become a water quarter, that they will not be organized, that they will be able to do harm to innocent lives. We bind you militia group. We bind you every man of evil and disease. We bind you. We bind you. We bind you. We rebuke you in the name of the Lord Jesus. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Lord, let freedom ring. Let freedom ring. Let lives be saved in the name of the Lord Jesus. Oh God, we decree it to be so God. We decree it to be so God. We decree it to be so God. Oh, in the name of Jesus. Oh God, cover our black men. Cover our black women. Oh God, cover our children. In the name of Jesus. We bind up every attack. Oh God, in the name of Jesus. Don't let it come to naught. Oh God, let it dispel. Let it be exposed. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Let every plot, every plan, every plan assassination be exposed. Let it be exposed. That it will not come to fruition. That it will not manifest in the name of the Lord Jesus. 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 
Oh God, we pray. Oh God, that you will be God. Oh God, that you will protect this country. That you will protect these now your people. Oh God. Oh God, I pray God. Oh God, I pray God. Oh God, that you will cover your houses of worship in the name of the Lord Jesus. Oh God, I pray today, God. Oh God, that you would move, God. Oh God, plant. We pray God for release of angels. Oh God, the saint at the doorposts of churches all across the country that they will not be victimized by civil unrest. We rebuke the spirit of evil that's lurking, that's plotting, that's planning for civil unrest. We come against you. The Lord God rebuke you. And Father, in the name of Jesus, oh God, you told us to pray and you told us to turn from our wicked ways. And Father, I pray God in the name of Jesus that you will forgive us, forgive us, forgive us, forgive us how we have not served you. Forgive us how we have not reverenced you. Forgive us, oh God. Forgive us and I pray for mercy, oh God. Oh God, for you are merciful. You are kind. You're long suffering and you love your people, oh God. And so Father, in the name of Jesus, I cry out for mercy. Mercy, mercy, mercy. Let mercy prevail in our country. Let mercy prevail in our cities. Let mercy Oh God, let mercy. Let mercy. Let mercy prevail in our communities. Let mercy. Oh God, mercy, mercy, mercy. Oh God, we plead mercy. Oh God, we plead the blood. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. Oh God, cover us. Cover these those under the sound of my voice. Oh my shaman. Oh God, cover. Cover your people, oh God. Oh God, cover your people, oh God. Cover your lady. Oh God, cover, cover, cover. Oh God, cover your people tonight. Cover your people tonight. Cover your people tonight. And oh God, we thank you today, God, because you're a miracle, God. Oh God, there's nothing too hard for you, God. And I pray right now, God. Oh God, in the name of Jesus, that mercy will prevail, God. Oh God, miracles, signs and wonders. I pray for those that's fighting fevers right now in the name of the Lord Jesus. I pray that your fever be regulated in the name of Jesus. I plead the blood of Jesus over high fevers in the name of Jesus, over infections in the name of Shatta. Oh God, in the name of Jesus, deliver healer. God, in the name of Jesus, heal God. Bring down the fevers. Bring down the fevers. Bring down the fevers. Bring down the fevers. In the name of the Lord Jesus, heal God. Heal God. And I know you can, God. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. Oh God, we thank you tonight. We thank you for the power of prayer. We thank you, God, as we link our faith up together. God, these your people in respective places in different cities and different states, oh God. We thank you, God. Oh God, for every city that's represented here in the name of the Lord Jesus. Oh God, I pray, God, God, that you will sweep through every city on this live today. And even those that will come on the rebroadcast, sweep through their cities, God. Sweep through the cities. Let the anointing flow. God in the name of the God in the name of Jesus, sweep through the city, sweep through the cities, sweep through the cities, and expose everything that's contrary to your will and your way. Clean it up, God. Oh God, clean it up, God. Clean up the cities. Clean up the cities. Clean it up, God. Sit it up, Oh God, clean it up. Clean it up, clean it up of evil. Clean it up, oh witchcraft. Clean it up, oh God. Oh Shaban Dolor Kushaya. Ah Shata Robo Kushaba. Yes, God. And the Yandolo Kushia. He shandala kosha. God do it in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, do it. Oh, God, do it. Father, we believe you and we trust you tonight. God, you are hope. You are strength. You're all that we got. You've been good to us, God. You bless us with material things and you bless us with jobs and you bless us with businesses and, and you've been good to us, God. You've been mighty to us, God. Oh, God, and we may not have praised you enough in all that you have done for us, but I pray on tonight, God, that you would hear our cry. Oh, God, hear the cries of your people 
oh God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, as we travail, oh God, oh my God, hear us tonight, hear us tonight, God, hear us tonight, oh God, hear us tonight, oh God, hear us tonight, oh God, oh God, hear us tonight, hear us tonight, hear us tonight, God, hear us tonight, God, do something in us, God, that we will not be able to refute, God, that it was you and you alone, God, do it for us tonight, that we know, God, that you're with us, that you're fighting for us, oh God, and those that fight against us, God, they fight against you, and those that talk against us, they talk against you, and Father, we thank you, God, that our arms and man's arms are too short to box with you, and so, Father, in the name of Jesus, we thank you tonight that every enemy that we have is an enemy of you, God, and Father, you told us that if we hold our peace, God, that you will fight our battles, and so, Father, we thank you tonight. We thank you for our people that's walking in sweatless victory. I thank you today, God, for a people that's walking in sweatless victory. I thank you for a people, oh God, that's walking in Holy Ghost boldness. I thank you for a people, oh God, that's not afraid or intimidated by the devil. I thank you for a people, oh God, oh God, that they engaged in war. I thank you for a people, oh God, that don't mind fighting for the glory of God. Oh God, I thank you for a people, oh God, that's walking in the assurance of who you've called them to be. I thank you for a people, oh God, that's walking in destiny. I thank you for, oh God, what you're doing in their life. I thank you for the fullness of the manifestation of that which you have said for the people, oh God. We thank you tonight for what you're doing in the life of your people, oh God. We thank you for a stirring. We thank you, God, for your raising your people up, God, that you're teaching them how to fight. You're showing them the way. You're ordering their footsteps in the name of Jesus. Oh God, we thank you tonight for what you're doing, God, for we are not ashamed of the gospel of Jesus Christ. We thank you, God, that it's not by our might or our power is by your strength, saith the Lord. God, we thank you, God. We thank you for the power of prayer. We thank you, God, that prayer changes things. We thank you, God, that prayer, oh God, move mountains. We thank you for the faith of the people. We thank you for faithful people that don't mind crying out to their God, saying, Abba, Father, thank you, God. Oh, God, as we're running for our life, we're not looking back. We're not taking no prisoners. God, we're going forth. In your name, God, I thank you tonight for the release. God, thank you. Thank you for the release, oh God. Thank you for the release of peace of mind. Thank you for peace in our mind. Oh God, thank you for peace in our spirit, God. Thank you for what you're doing, oh Lord, Thank you, thank you, thank you. 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 Thank you, thank you. God, we had 10,000 tongues, oh God. We could not thank you enough. You're so awesome. You're so magnificent. And you're so worthy to be praised. We appreciate you, oh God. And we thank you. God, that you're breaking. God, that you're breaking every stronghold. Oh my, God, you're breaking. You're breaking every chain. You're breaking every chain. You're breaking every chain of evil influence. Oh God, I thank you, God, for yokes being destroyed. I thank you, God, for healing bodies tonight. I thank you, God, for regulating minds. I thank you, God, that we're walking in victory. Thank you, God, for what you're doing. Thank you, God. Oh, God, for your power. Oh, Shatai. God, thank you for your power. 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 Oh, God. Thank you, God. Thank you. God, I thank you. God, I thank you. Lord, I thank you, God. I thank you, God, that you're releasing your people out of bondage, that you're releasing your people out of evil influences. Oh, God, you're breaking chains right now. I hear chains falling, falling, falling. And Father, we thank you tonight. Thank you for spiritual liberation, God, that we're going to be free to praise you and free to pray to you and free to believe you and trust you in spite of what we see, God. Oh, my goodness gracious. I thank you, oh, God. Thank you, oh, God. Thank you, Yeshua. God, thank you. Thank you. Oh God, thank you. Thank you for who you are. Thank you for how you're moving in our life. Oh God, I thank you, God. Oh God, I thank you, God. I thank you. 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 Oh God, I thank you for your power. And thank you for your blessed assurance. Thank you, oh God. Thank you. 
Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you, God. Thank you. Glory to my shot time. Thank you, God. Thank you. Thank you, God. You're so worthy to be praised, oh God. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, God. If we had 10,000 tongues, we could not thank you enough. You're so awesome and you're so worthy to be praised. And thank you for being the center of our life and the center of our joy. Thank you, God, that we could put our trust in you because you care for us. God, I thank you, God. I thank you, Lord. I thank you. I thank you for your power. I thank you for your power. God, we thank you. We love you. We adore you. We magnify you. And we ask all these awesome things in your precious name. And thank you. God, I thank you for these, your people under the sound of my voice. I thank you. And Father, as I say again, if there be, if I have any favor with you, dear God, I pray that you would bless these, your people. Bless each and every one of them under the sound of my voice. Bless them. Bless them. Let favor open doors for their life. Favor be their portion. I pray, God, the blessings of the Lord will make them rich and out of no sorrow. I pray, oh God, God, that you will heal bodies, regulate minds, do impossible things for them in their life. Do supernatural miracles, signs and wonders. Let it be the order of the day. Father, I pray, oh God, that you would move and move in the realm of their heart's desire for the faithful. Father, I thank you for who you are in our life. Thank you for keeping us. Thank you for this time of prayer and intercession. Lord, we adore you. And we know without a shadow of a doubt, there is nothing too hard for you. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen and amen. Listen, beloved, God is good and all the time he's good. And he is so worthy to be praised. I thank God for each and every one of you that have logged in tonight to come to prayer on a Monday night. Let me caution y'all. God is moving right now as we speak. And I want y'all to know, don't you dare let that devil steal what you got. Some of you have been touched and received an impartation from the Lord. Don't you dare let that devil steal what you got. And let me tell you something. I would encourage each and every one of you after this prayer to get off of social media and go into straight prayer and lay out before the Lord and bless him. Because some of you don't even realize what God did for you right while we were praying today. Some of you don't have a clue that God dispatched angels on your behalf, that God is moving for you in the area of finances and working out some things legally for you. While we were praying right tonight, God is moving behind the scenes. There's been angels dispatched on your behalf to fight and war for you in the spirit. I'm telling you what I know. God is working behind the scenes and he is fighting on your behalf. Don't you dare let that devil steal what you received on tonight. Get in a place and position yourself in prayer so that you don't lose what you got. I'm telling you, God did something for you tonight. I know he did. I know it by the spirit of God. And he's done something for you tonight. And don't you dare let that devil steal you. Because that's what he do. He's a robber. He's a thief. He don't want the people of God to succeed. But he's a lying wonder. You're going to pers persevere and you're going to mount up as eagles anyway. And let me tell you something. I don't care what nobody say. They don't have the power. Oh, my God. To undo what God has said. Because God finna bless you. Do you hear what I'm saying? God finna bless you. And there's some things right behind the scenes. That you don't even know. That God is working out. Let me tell you what he's first working out. Let me tell y'all something. When we were praying. I felt a release. God is breaking the power of witchcraft. Off of people's life. And every other kind of wit or craft off their life. There's a strong spirit of demonic influence that is being broken. And I'm telling you, God is moving by his power and he is breaking it. He is breaking it. That spirit of control and manipulation is being broken off your life. 
Each time you come into prayer, God is doing something supernatural. But somebody received their true full deliverance tonight. And I'm telling you, it's broken. And let me tell you something. You're going to know. You're going you're gonna to experience it. You're going to know. Because I'm going to tell you, your money getting ready to flow. Doors is getting ready to swing open. Because this type of influence, that demonic influence, had you bound, had you tore up. Where you couldn't move. You couldn't go forward. You couldn't go to the left. You couldn't go to the side. Because of that demonic influence. But I'm telling you what I know. The chains of evil is broken in the name of the Lord Jesus. It's broken in the name of Jesus. You will not be stuck another day in your life. God has broken that chain. That evil influence is broken off your life right now in the name of Jesus. And you're going to flow like you've never flowed before. In the things of God, in your finances, in your purpose, in your next plan, you're getting ready to flow. No more hindrances and no more delay. Oh, God did it. He did it for, for you today. He did it for you. He did it for you. He did it for you. Oh, yes, he did. He did it for you. So I tell you, people of God, God is good. And all the time he's good. People can say whatever they want. I ain't stunning them. Prayer works. God is real. And I don't care if you don't believe it or not. I believe enough for everybody. Hear me. God is real. He is real. And he can heal you. He can touch you. He can deliver you. He can set you free. You don't have to be stuck. That devil's a liar. The devil's telling you you ain't going to make it. No, you're going to make it. And then some. Oh, yes. I'm telling you what I know. And God is good. I tell you, people of God, no matter what, hold on to God's unchanging hand. I love the Lord with all my heart. All I know is what I know. And I stick to what I know. And what I know for sure is that God loves us. Yes, he does. And don't you let no devil tell you that God don't love you. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Don't let no devil tell you that God don't care for you. But he do. And he loves you much. Listen, y'all, I love y'all so much. And I thank God for each and every time y'all come together along with me as we come to prayer. Uh, listen, people, I, I, I love to pray. I love the Lord because I believe him. I believe him. And I want you to believe him too. I want you to trust him too. I want you to know that he is able to do it for you. Amen. So beloved, make sure that you Prepare yourself. We're going to have a prayer at 12 midnight, starting on Halloween, uh, October 31st at 12 midnight, right here on this platform. We're going to be praying. I got a host of intercessors that will be praying and bar bar to heaven along with me, because I'm telling you, we've, we, 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 we are going to put an attack on evil. We get ready to sin and banish evil back to the pits of hell. Okay. So we're getting ready to pray like crazy. Do you hear what I'm saying? So we just bless the Lord and uh, join us on Wednesday for Bible study. Amen. As we continuously to walk through this word in Genesis, I tell you, heaven and earth shall pass away, but it is the word of God that will stand. Join me as we continue this journey through Bible study. God is going to continue to do some great things in your life as you hold on to his word and hold on to his promises. Listen, y'all. I love y'all. Thank y'all so much for joining me. I appreciate you. I love you. Thank God to all the leaders of I Want to See You Win. You are a faithful people. I appreciate you all. You are a faithful people. I can never tell y'all enough how much I appreciate y'all. You all are faithful people. Thank you for coming to prayer. Amen. Thank you, Pastor Derek Miles, for all that you do. Amen. And thank you for everybody else. I love you. I really do. I pray for you all the time. Amen. And may the Lord bless you and keep you is my prayer. May his glory shine his face upon you, that you'll be blessed coming in and going out, that he will make you the head and not the tail. he make you above and not beneath. May you be blessed. Oh my God, be blessed ever the more in Jesus name. God bless y'all. Bye-bye.